Girlies, it's mini twist season. So let's get this tutorial started. I used free trust braid for the kids, the kids version, the pre-fluffed kind, 12 inches. I didn't cut it, nothing like that. I used extra hole jam and edge booster edge control, some clips to hold my puffs back, and then these clips to hold down my twisties. Everything will make sense in just a minute. So let's get started. So as you can see, I used that clip to hold back these sections and I went in and pre-did these sections because it just makes everything quicker and easier to do, okay? And I'm using my edge booster to do these pre sections. So going ahead, going ahead and parting it and then twisting it off so that when I'm getting ready to twist, I can just grab a section that's already done and then get started. I took the hair out of the pack, split it in half, and then took the half and split that in half and took the other half and split that in half. So all in all, after you're done splitting, you should have four pieces in all, okay? Don't worry, it's gonna be thick enough, okay? Trust me, trust the process. I like to go ahead, like, excuse me, and lay out all of the pieces of hair, lay out everything that I need and pick a very comfortable space to start twisting. Then I underestimated how tired I was and I called in reinforcement, okay? Um, then while she was there, we got to talking and then I also realized I have a problem with asking for help. So I was like, girl, don't worry about it. You just sit there, let's talk and I'm gonna braid my own hair. And she was like, really, Jessica? And I was like, really? This is the second day. I was sitting down watching, um, I forgot what this movie was called, but it's on Prime. And y'all, this movie was so weird and so interesting, okay? Took me forever to braid my hair, child, okay? This woman fell in love with a genie in a bottle, child. I mean, it's Idris Elbra, so he, he was cute. Anyway, um, this is the third day. <laughs> this is the third day. No, it's not. This is still the second day. I just changed my shirt. I just changed my shirt. Okay, so I'm just twisting here and you know, questioning my life when I cut the ends off. And in just a few minutes, this is what we're looking like so far. In a few minutes, I'm gonna show you how I got the twist, okay? So this is the third day, third and final day. And I was like, really? Did I really do this to myself? But it looked good, so I was like, it's gonna be a reward in the end, okay? So I just went ahead and parted off some more and then twisted them off like I showed you in the beginning of the video because as you can see, I'm just pulling and twisting. So let me show you how I did it. I take the hair and I twist it in the middle, wrap it underneath my hair, bring it around and pull it tight. Not too tight now, you know your edges, okay? Um, and then I braid down. Don't ask me how many times I braid it down because I really just braid it down until I knew that that twist wasn't gonna slide off of my hair. So this is just one way to do it. And this is the way I do it when the section that I um, pre-twisted before I start twisting with the extension hair was thin. That's the way I do it when it's super thin. Now the second way I do it when that section is a little thicker is the same thing. Just twist it in the middle, wrap it around my hair, okay? Pull it over, pull it tight, not too tight, and then start braiding down. Now the only difference from the first time I showed you is that I just braid down and once I braid down enough to know that this twist is not going to slide off of my hair, then I go in, check it, and then I take my piece of hair, my real hair, and I split it in the middle, just like that, and then I twist it on each side to blend it with the hair and then continue to twist down. Now, while I'm twisting down, I'm not gonna take my edge control, but I'm gonna take the jam and just put some of that jam to continue to hold the hair together while I'm twisting down. And this keeps it from frizzing up. Now, as the twists get older, they will frizz up, but it's gonna look so much better. It's gonna look natural. Then I'm taking some more of that jam and just twisting the ends and it curls up. And this is how we're looking. And this is how my hair turned out, you guys. So cute, I love it. It's so lightweight. It, it literally feels like I don't have any extensions in my hair. And it's stretchy, it's bouncy, and I absolutely loved doing this entire style. I would say this definitely takes a lot of patience and also, I mean, it's a self-care day, even though it took me three self-care days, okay? And this is how my hair ended up looking on Instagram, period. Okay, guys, bye. You're welcome.